Friday 25th of May. Now we're just packed away here, getting back on the road again now, three days here in Cappadocia. Ended up being better than we ever expected. I saw videos and things on YouTube, but it's better to see it in real life. It's, uh, that was a great place. So now we're on the road. Next place we're heading to is the next country, is Georgia. It's about 900 kilometers away. I'm not sure how long it's going to take. Maybe two weeks. I don't know yet. But, uh, that's been good. We've been spending our time sightseeing and then the rest of the time we've just been discussing visas because now it's turning into a real hassle. But uh, Iran seems to be sorted out. But the next problem is we need to get Turkmenistan and Uzbekistan at the same time coordinated. So that's not so easy. So that's the next project. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, we'll see if we can sort it out. We'll see. I'll tell you more about that later, maybe. Okay, let's uh, get into the town here, get some food, and we'll be back on the bikes again. Okay, back on the road again. Just left uh, Gorim. The road was actually really nice out of Gorim, but couldn't film it because it was just raining a lot. So, yeah, but uh, now we're rolling again. No idea where we're going to stay this evening. We're on the way to. Kaiseri, it's a big city, industrial city. Not sure whether we'll go into the centre or whether we'll just bypass it. We'll see how it goes. It's already afternoon, so it took us a while to get going this morning after all the visa discussions we have to have and finding out how we get the visas for different countries. So. Uh, We're rolling again. We've got a few days now where there's not going to be that many interesting things to look at, but, uh, but like other times we think that and then something interesting pops up. We'll see how it goes. There's just a few days of just transport riding. We'll see. But the plan is just to ride and camp, ride and camp, ride and camp until we get to a town called Ezerum. Then like Meadow and Jamie will pick up their Iran visas there that they got. Their application was approved straight away, so no problems for them whatsoever. Really easy. Instead of all the hassle that I have just because I have a British passport instead of a Danish one. Unbelievable, but that's the way that is. But uh, we'll do some biking now, a few days, see how far we get. Scenery so far is just one big open space today. I see a mountain appearing in the background there. I see should be coming close to that a little bit later today, tomorrow. Apart from that, there's not much not towns or anything to look at, it's just open space. Roadside camping tonight. Turtle camping. This is called, and I'll show you why it's called turtle camping. Because something moving in the bushes, I just noticed, and there's a turtle here or tortoise. <laughs> Always a friend for Jamie to play with, no matter where we are. <laughs> yeah. And there we can see Kaiseri in the distance. There's a mountain there, I'll just check the name of that. There's a Mount Essius. It's a place you can go skiing. So, that'll be a nice view tonight. That's the road down there we'll be taking in the morning. So, yeah. 40 kilometers or so. Not bad when we set up at 1 o'clock. So. It's okay. It's okay. Wanted to do 30, so we did 40. It's pretty good. That's okay. We'll get the tent up. the end of our first day on the bikes again. 
just stopped 20 kilometers short of Khoisari, that's actually the city you can see down below us there, actually a city of 1 million people, it's quite big really. And we stopped before we entered the, the, uh, the city, it's just easier for us to camp up here in the hills than end up in the city there, then we'd uh, find it difficult to find a camping spot in the city, so um, we stopped here, really nice spot, quiet spot on the hills here. The view over to the city below, great. So tomorrow we'll be, yeah, back rolling again. Now it's just mainly just to keep on the road, cover as much distance as we can each day, and yeah, get as close to Israel as possible. So and the next few days are going to be the same. So that's it. Not big excitement, but just a bit of travelling now to do, and, uh, a few kilometres to do on the bike. So okay, see you tomorrow.